everyone and happy Tuesday. Now we had a nice day of weather yesterday, nice and calm. Uh, and it helped that the flooding is starting to subside, although it's not quite the end of flooding season just yet here. We do have a little bit more to get through uh, as far as flooding is concerned, but I just wanted to take a look at the general weather pattern that we've got going on right now. We've got this big ridge, and this is a high pressure that is to our northwest, kind of situated in that area. So things are quiet in Montana right now. We have this low, though, off to our southwest, and and depending on where that moves this week, that will affect our weather later on in the week. But things were relatively quiet yesterday and they're going to be clear and quiet for today as well. So you can see on the radar here, pretty quiet uh, with the exception of just a little bit of noise. That's not any rain moving through, just something that the radar is picking up that isn't necessarily anything weather related. But the, although things are quiet in Montana, other folks in the southern part of the country getting lots of severe storms here. There was a flash flood uh, warning in southern Missouri earlier and all the way up into the Great Lakes area. Lots of rain falling and they're experiencing some flooding issues as well, although more of the heavy rain type of flooding issues, uh, flash flooding uh, as opposed to the aerial flooding that we've gotten here uh, with the snow melt and the rain. We've had lots of issues with that, although that is no news to anyone here in Montana if you've been paying any attention to the weather at all. So getting into the watches and warnings, we've got a flood warning along the Muscle Shell River here. That's until Thursday morning. And I said that things are kind of quieting down right now, short term, but long term. We do still have lots more flooding ahead in Lewis and Clark County, still under a flood warning until Thursday evening. So although things may seem quiet now, uh, we've got a lot more snow that is going to be melting off. This is just a look at some of the snowpack uh, totals that were updated yesterday. Uh, this area here, 213% uh, of normal. So this is comparing it to what we would normally see at this time in the year. Lots of places are still above normal. So we still have lots more snow that needs to melt off and we've got more rain coming later on this week. So today things are going to be clear, but tomorrow you can see some showers starting to move in tomorrow, uh, continuing later on this week, especially Thursday, later on on Thursday into Friday. That's going to be kind of a showery day on Friday and things won't be uh, there won't be too much accumulation until later on this week. Friday is going to be the biggest day for rain and uh, that is really going to amp up the flooding later on this week. So things are going to stay quiet today. It's going to be a nice day to uh, get outside, enjoy some sunshine because starting tomorrow that kind of kicks off a stormy pattern that's going to stick around until the end of the week. But fortunately, the weekend is looking pretty quiet for now. Uh, some showers coming in 